What up Sailor Senshi? I'm Sailor Snubs and today I have my very first Sailor Moon merchandise review for you. So I usually do a ton of unboxings on this channel but whenever I receive something that is brand new and that is currently available online or in stores at a certain place I'll be happy to do a review. If there is anything that you see me unbox on this channel that you want to see in more depth definitely let me know and I would love to do a video on it for you. So for today's episode I am doing an unboxing as well as a review of the brand new Proplica from Bandai and Tamashi Nations. And this is called the Sailor Uranus Transformation Lip Rod. And as you can see from this gorgeous packaging, it has a really pretty gold foil on the front and there's this pretty filigree on each of the corners. It also features a nice design of the lip rod itself and then there's a background picture of Sailor Uranus. There's a toy sticker right next to the word Proplica at the top in case you are looking for one that is actually real and not from some third party. At the bottom of this it says Bandai Collector Shop and it also has little slogans for Bandai as well as Tamashi Nations. If we look at each of the sides of this packaging, the bottom and the top are both the same and they both say Proplica, Transformation Lip Rod, Sailor Uranus with the pretty filigree and some little sparkles with gold foil. And on the first side we have a photograph of the lip rod, the actual Proplica that you'll receive in the box. On the other side we have a little bit more information about it. So it has the Sailor Uranus Lip Rod and then there is a photo of the Sailor Neptune Lip Rod on here too. You can buy both of these together or separate, it doesn't really matter, but each of them has a stand so that they can be connected together, which is really pretty and kind of romantic too. You can tell whether this one is the international version or the Japanese version. I have the international one because it has an English sticker on the back of here that has <laughs> choking hazard information to allow it to be sold in America, but underneath that is a bunch of Japanese information as well. You will notice on the back that it takes three LR44 batteries and you can find those on Amazon as well as Target in places like CVS and Walgreens. I'm gonna go ahead and open this up so you can see what it looks like on the inside. All right so on the inside of the packaging you receive a few different things. The first item in the packaging is a little step-by-step -step guide as far as how to use your transformation lip rod Proplica. So this features information on how to install the batteries as well as how to use all of the different modes because you do you get voice activation and you get background music with this Proplica. There's an English instruction manual. I believe this is just with the English version that ships, but this has information on it as well about how to use it, including a mode selection switch on the side. There's a music switch and an activation switch for each of the selected modes, and it shows you where the power switch is as well. And I'll show you each of those on the Proplica. Now the stand is made out of plastic, just like all of the previous Proplicas, and it does strangely include two different versions of the mount. So the first one mounts on both sides of the handheld part of the lip rod, which is really nice so it won't move around, it won't fall or anything since it is a little bit top heavy, let's be honest. But I can also remove that and I can put in the other mount, which allows it to be mounted sideways. So it's pretty cool that you can mount it either way and it allows you to display this in whichever way you prefer. So I really like that they included both of these display mounts. I think for myself I'll probably display it this way so that you can see it when it's sitting behind me and then I'll probably just keep this in the packaging and hopefully I don't lose it down my shirt. Okay so I'll go ahead and go through this guide real quick. It is in Japanese so it looks like on the first page it talks a little bit about Sailor Uranus and Sailor Neptune probably. Uranus. Yeah and then the next page on there discusses the different features of the lip rod. So on the back page you also have directions on how to set it up with those two different mounts. You also have a little bit of directions about how to set it up with the Sailor Neptune mount as well so you can have them displayed side by side which is so cute and romantic. And then it also has information about how to take out those batteries, how to put in new ones. Strangely this one does include batteries in the packaging which is actually really cool 
and I appreciate that they did that because that saves me time and lots of money. You can find this Proplica currently for around $74.99 or $75. It's available on a lot of different websites. Tokyo Otaku Mode has it, as well as Big Bad Toy Store, I believe is the name of it, and a lot of Japanese stores too, like Hobby Link and J-List. When you look at the Proplica itself, it has a bunch of different colors going on here, and it is based on the anime version of the lip transformation wand. So at the top you have a very blue mirrored sphere, it's really pretty, and then in the center there's a pink outlined heart which is also mirrored so if I look at it I can totally use it as a mirror. There's a baby blue hand held part which is a little bit short to be honest, and then at the bottom we have this really shiny gold end to it. Uh, the back has the speaker, so this is the speaker on the back, and then there's a couple of buttons. So on the side the first button is the mode selection switch, so you can press it once for transform mode, twice for character voice sound mode, and then three times for transform mode without voice. Uh, apparently, I believe that's how you use it. And then the bottom one is the music switch, and you can press this to play three different patterns of background music, which will also work while you're using the voice activation mode too. On the opposite side is the activation switch. You have to press that once to activate each of the modes that you go through on the lip transformation wand proplica. Now, if I pop open the back, oh good. Good. I was a little worried that that would be harder to pop off, but you do have a little piece of paper here that you pull out to activate the batteries. So I'll do that. And then you have a couple of screws and that is how you can take off the battery compartment and replace the batteries underneath it. And then there's the activation switch. So I believe the first switch, which is A or one little dot on there is simply to turn it on. was so cool. Let's do it again. Now you'll notice that on the front there is a little Uranus symbol and when I turn it on it lights up. That's so cool. And it looks like you can turn down the volume by moving the slider over to the two little dots instead of the one little dot. So one dot means it's turned on like the normal volume and then two dots is turning it down. That's awesome. Okay, so since that is turned on, I'm gonna go ahead and put the backing back on and it just clips back on so there's no issues there. You don't need screws to take it back off and on if you just need to turn it on. But I'm gonna go ahead and go through all of the different sounds on here so you can hear them. Let's see if I can figure this out. So this is just hitting it once, hitting the activation mode once. Okay, let's see what happens if I hit the activation mode again. Squirrel chicken! So that's her attack. That was dope. Okay. Is this the same one again? I think it is. Yeah, it's the same one. Oh, it was slightly different. Okay, so that was the first one again. So there's, it sounded like there were four different modes on there, I believe, with just hitting the activation switch. So if I hit the top, button on this side which chooses the transform mode and then hit activation oh i guess this is character voice mode the first one was transform mode so this is character voice mode so that was the first voice mode Okay. 
she done? Yo, Uranus always sounds so stressed out. Oh, she's still going. You done? Girlfriend? Yeah? Okay. Mate! Neptune! I don't know what she said. Look out. Dang girl. See, stressed out. Is that it? Oh. She talks so much. So I think we're going in a circle now. All right, so next, I'm gonna hit the mode selection switch again and activation. So these are transformation modes without the voice activation noises. Sounds like world shaking. So if I hit it again, this should go back to the regular transform mode with the voice. Okay. Cool, okay. So that's one. And then we have the music switch, which is on the bottom over here. So if I press that. Love the violin, it's so good. So you can play the background music in a loop forever and if you press the activation mode button again, it will play the voice activated mode, the transform mode, over the background music. So that's pretty cool. So pressing the music mode again will fade the music out. And then if you press it again, it'll start up the next music. that music. Cool. Dun, dun, dun. All right, y'all already know what this music sounds like, so I won't keep on playing it. But it's so pretty. Okay. Now if I play it again, it goes back to the transformation song, the background music. Awesome. Okay, I think that is everything that this can do. I don't think I'm missing anything, but if I am, uh, comment below. But that's cool. I'm surprised that it has so many sounds built into this thing, but I'm really excited to get the Sailor Neptune lip transformation rod as well, because these will be displayed together, which will look so, so pretty. But until that time, this will sit by its lonely self and I should remember to turn it off so I don't drain the battery. Okay, so that was the Sailor Neptune Lip Transformation Rod Proplica, which you can currently buy online. It is super pretty, and I'm really, really happy that I was able to find one for a good price before they ended up going in price and selling out everywhere, which seems to happen every single time there is a Proplica. So this was really pretty. It's awesome. It's gonna look great back there with the rest of my little collection that I have going on back here. Let me know if you have any questions about how to use this or how to install 
install the batteries or any questions about any of the other proplicas that I have currently back here. I'm still missing the kaleidoscope. I'm hoping that I can find that one for a decent price, but right now it's like crazy expensive. Make sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on my 500 subscriber giveaway once we get to 500 subscribers and make sure to like this video and comment below if you enjoyed it. And until next time, again, my name is Sailor Snubs. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Johnny.